welcome to another tutorial on Google Spreadsheet. Uh, I'm going to explain you how you can import feed into your spreadsheet. First you have to do is find the feed that you want to import. In my case I'm going to import official feed of Google and I'm going to copy the feed URL or you can just copy the URL that you want and paste it to here okay so once you do that second thing to do is type import feed after that you have to give it URL then you have to give item content third parameter as false and then number of feed items that you want to import once you do that just press enter okay so what I have here is a false value for example parameter to value is item content it should be feed or feed title or feed description or you can have items or items title let's edit it again and type for items and enter again which it show us the feed okay so it is showing us the feed okay we will just expand this and see how it got the first feed so all that it did is it got the content of this post which is first post and added into here likewise all 10 posts with their content is copied here let's select everything and remove it and we will start with one more feed so let's see if I can import feed from my own blog import feed http Code.net, then where it should be item, then false, and then five. Okay, now press enter. So I have this error. So what is it? Okay, I have to press Okay, now let's see what it loads Not available. So let's try to find out What we can add find full feed let's try to print it out so again we'll try it as if it has no feed or let's say RSS okay
so it is not actually showing us the feed because it is RSS which is not passed with feed or items header so we will type it again and find out what else we can do so let's type something like Google blog dot blogspot dot com then we have here it's B3 okay and then we have false and then five is not applicable get all the queries okay so we will import our example feed here and see how it works now let's okay so we have our feed imported from Google News here is the title and then source then URL and then small paragraph or you can say past subscript so this is how the feeds are imported into your Google spreadsheet. You can then format it and create your own small curated content web page and you can publish it somewhere or you can just uh, push it to email and let others read it or you can just capture the important information like say if you have any stock broker website where there is content from RSS feed you just can download on this spreadsheet then collect the important information discard the rest and have it in your records that is another one of the use that you can have you can also use it for Wikipedia feeds right so that is also possible there are many other use of this import feed feature so I'll leave it to you to find out and I hope you are having good time with these tutorials and have fun